Hello, dear student. How are you doing? Are you okay? Today, I'm going to teach you this wonderful lesson. I'm going to teach you how to use verb to take in different ways. In other words, I'm going to show you different meanings with verb to take. Are you ready to hear, to understand, to grasp, to get this lesson? Good. Before teaching you the lesson, I have our today's word, which is Heavenly Father. What is the meaning of Heavenly Father? Heavenly Father means God. God is our Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, bisobanura imana. Data wa tukwese urimijuru. Mucho njereza tumita, Heavenly Father, God, Papa urimijuru. Heavenly Father. For example, I can say, I am relying on my Heavenly Father. No one else I can rely on. I am relying on my or our Heavenly Father. No one else I can rely on. That is Heavenly Father. The meaning of heavenly father means God. Nukvuango heavenly father is our God, Almighty. Imani jira mazina menshi ni rirero ugomba kuri menya. Yes, heavenly father. Good. Then verb to take in different meanings or in different ways. Verb to take mubusoba nuro budiye butando kanye. Changwa muzira zitando kanye. Before teaching you the lesson. Dear students, I want to show you these important materials for you. These are wonderful English books that I have here. They can help you uplift, level up your English language. Don't hesitate to come and buy them. Witinda kuza kubigura. Kuko ibitabo ni ingenzi. Jigushira na rero. Nibigushira nine. Nguino ubigure. Nibigushira na. Nice. Then uh, we are going to start with the first, the first expression with the verb to take. The first expression is to take a rest. What is the meaning of take a rest? To take a rest means to relax in order to get back your strength. That is to take a rest. To relax after a long period of time of working or after working for a long period of time. That is to take a rest. To take a rest, nugufata akaruhuko. After working, nyumayogukora. In order to get back your strength. Kujirango ugaruri mbaraga watakaj. That is to take a rest. To get back the strength means kugarura imbaraga. To take a rest. For example, I can say, Oh, I am very exhausted now. Let me first take a rest. Or I am very exhausted now. Let me take a rest first. Rekambanze mfata karuhuko before continuing my job. Mbereyogu komeza akazikanji. That is to take a rest. For example, I can say employees took a rest yesterday before they continued their job. Luvango, abakozi bafashe akaruhuko. You can say employees had taken a rest for two hours before they continued their job yesterday. Yes. Abakozi baba anje gufata akaruhuko kama sahabiri ejo hashize mbere yuko bakomeza kazikawu. That is what we call to take a rest. Then here we have to take a nap. To take a nap is to sleep for a short period of time. That is to take a nap. Sleeping for a short period of time is taking a nap. For example, I can say, oh, I am very tired now. Let me take a nap. Ndarushechane, let me take a nap. Let me take a siesta. To take a siesta or to take a nap means to sleep for a short period of time. Nugu sinzira byakanya gato kujirango ni iburumu na niro ugabanyuchi. Ushobora go taking a nap, a nap uga komeza kazi. Nyuma yogu taking a nap. Nyuma yogu yoku jama akanya gato. Then to take a nap means to, to sleep for a short period of, ta, 
of time. Then after, after sleeping, nyumayuko usinziriye, when you wake up, you can continue your job. Ushawarangu komeza akazi. For example, you can say, I, I always take a nap at 1 p.m. I always take a nap at 1 p.m. That is to take a nap. Then what time do you take a nap? What time do you take a nap? My dear friend, at your job, what time do you take a nap at job? What time do you take a nap? At job, oh teacher, I take a nap at 2 p.m. I take a nap at 2 p.m. Mfata akaruhuko kogu sinzira, sinzira byakanya gato samunan. That is to take a nap. My dearest students, this is the third expression for you to know. To take a look. To take a look means to examine means to check. This means to examine or to check. For example, I can say, my doctor is taking a look at my throat. Throat? At my throat. My doctor is taking a look at my throat. 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 Do you know the meaning of throat? Throat means umhogo. Dokteri ari guchekinga, ari gususuma. That is to take a look. Ari kuna none to take a look, ningho kuitejereza. Changwa se kureva. Guchekingi chinu. For example, I can tell you, dear student, I have got a very wonderful English book. Please take a look at it. To take a look at this book, that is to take a look. Uh, yesterday, John bought a wonderful telephone and I took a look at it and I found out that it was a very nice telephone. Then after, that is to take a look. Then to take care. Take care. You ngo please take care. Is to be cautious. To be cautious. To take care means to be cautious. You ngo please take care. ngo itonde. For example, I can see someone who is sleeping or someone who are sleeping. Please you are sleeping. Take care. You may fall into this fire. People are sitting near the fireplace or around the fireplace. Please take care. Don't, fall, don't sleep, please, near this fireplace. Because if you sleep, you may fall into this fire. That is to take care. Nice. Then, uh, please take care. I'm going to Dubai. I leave you now and take care. That is to take care. Nice. Then we have to take a shower. To take a shower means to wash your body. It means to wash your body. It is simply means to wash the body. Yes, to take a shower. For example, you can say, I always take a shower before going to job. That is to take a shower. What time do you take a shower? I, I am addressing to you. What time do you take a shower? Teacher, teacher, I take a shower at 8 a.m. every morning. Buri mujitondo, buri jitondo, ni yuhajira sambiri zijitondo. That is to take a shower. Then here we have to take a break. To take a break means to take a rest. Take a break, take a rest. Oh, 
I'm not going to take a break because I have so many things to, to do. I am not going to take a break today because I have so many things to do. Uyu musi nabu ndi ufataka ruhuku. Sindi guruhu uche kukomti wimu jinshi. Jogu kora. Because I am overloaded. When you are overloaded, ufite jinshi jogu kora. You are very busy doing things. Nice. Then here we have to take advantage. To take advantage means to profit. Nugu profita. Changwa se nugu profiti chinu runaka. For example, I can say, oh, it is sunny outside. Let me take advantage of this sunny day and dry my clothes. Let me take advantage of this sunny day and dry my clothes. Reka profite uyumusi wizuba na nike imienda yanj. That is to take advantage. Then here we have to take care of. To take care of, of one. To take care of means to treat, to look after. That is to take care of. For example, I can say, she's the one who takes care of her family. She's the one who takes care of her family. No one else takes care of her family except her. For example, I can say, that man takes care of us every day. That is to take care of. Nice. Then here we have to take a photo. Last week, we took so many photos in that wedding. Last week, we took so many photos in that wedding. Gabukwe to take a photo, no gufata ma photo. Nice. Then um gufati photo to take a photo. To take a photo. Nibari menshi to take photos. In the simple past, take ya hindutse took. Last week we took so many photos in that wedding. Nice. Then to take a risk. To take a risk in no gufata risk. To take a risk. For example, I can say, umuna shwa kuku girati. You should take a risk if you want to be rich. You should take a risk if you want to be rich. Ni gushaka guchira ugomba gufata risk. Ugomba nyine gufata risk. That is to take a, ri a risk. Then after getting this lesson, take a rest, take a nap, take a look, take care, take a shower, take a break, take advantage, take care of, take a photo, and take a risk. After getting this lesson, allow me to give you the message of the day. Nyemeranguhe ubutumwa bw'umunsi. Nabwo ni ingenzi cyane. Buragufasha cyane. Let's go. My dear student, this is your message. Don't take a rest after your first victory. Because if you fail in second, more lips are waiting to say that your first victory was just lucky. Don't take a rest after your first victory. Because if you fail in a second, more lips are waiting to say that your first victory was just luck. Misha Tsubugichi. Nuhuki jere ufata karuhuko, uchimara gutsinda intsinzi imge. Uchimara gutsi ndari mge uhungu umbe ko viranji ye ufataka ruhuko. No. Kumera ko, nufataka ruhuko umaze gutsi ndi nzi nzi mge. Uga tsi nguwa buga kabiri. Mo lips imi nguwa mnyishi. Iza tanjira kufuga. Changwa se iza bute jereji tanje kufuga ngo. Uyumunu ya jizate ya wonye ili ya victory ya mbere kufuga mahirwe. Muri mache nuga tume awa nubavuga. Guda tuma wa nuwa vugarero is to keep on working. Nugu komeza gukora. Kuko, nu rechera ho gukora. Uga tsinda vga ambere. Tuvuze, tuvuje ubo nyimo doka vira ranjiye. Uumvise ko wajezeyo. Changwa se uba tsinzu vira ranjiye. Uumvise ko wajezeyo. Nuku vuga ngo more lips. Aba nuwa za tegeleza wa vuga bati. Nugu ninabjo ya koze. Ahogo na mahirgo ya mugu iri. Kuko, aba nuwa te ije chose. Baba shaka kufuga. Ibita jenda neza kuri wawe. Kujira ngoreru wa hime, you should keep on working. If you stop working and you take a rest, 
more people will start leaping. Do you know to leap? Bazatangira kuvuga bakoresheje their lips. Uh, then please don't stop working. Keep on going forward. Keep on stepping forward in life. Komeza muhuzima. I am teacher Jasper. We are together for the next lessons. Bye bye.